Hi, my name is Michael David Clark. I'm 73 inches tall and I weigh 250 pounds. Well, honestly, it's more like 255. I weigh 265 pounds, but I wasn't always this heavy. The day I tore through my mother's uterus, I was 8 pounds 9 ounces. This is a picture of my mother. Her weight on the moon is 30 pounds. There are no known pictures of her uterus. This is a picture of my father, James Clark. He was 207 pounds at the time of my birth. He weighed 250 pounds three years later at the time of his death. I guess he weighs less now. This is my TV. It's 42 inches in diameter and it weighs 30 pounds. This is my reflection. It's weightless. This is my favorite drink. I like it by the ounce. This is my bestest friend in the whole world, Miles. It sounds like a cute idea, but it's true. Miles is a big fat cat. He weighs about 8 pounds, 9 ounces, which is a lot for a kitty. Want to see some of my drawings? Ooh, ah, ooh, I really like that one. That's a good picture. This is my collage. And these are my inspirations. This is Matt Stone and Trey Parker. Daniel Johnston. This is Steve Zahn, Willy Wonka, A Clockwork Orange. This is Stephen Colbert and Bill Clinton and John Stewart and George Carlin and the infamous Lenny Bruce. This is Alfred Hitchcock and Martin Luther King and of course, Kurt Vonnegut. I guess you could say they were surrogates. This is my guitar. I'd like to play you a song if I could. All right, Mike, hit it. I've got a soul that's made of coal and it burns all day and it burns all day. Oh, I've got a soul that's made of coal and it burns all day and it burns all day. Oh, I've got a soul and it's made of coal and it burns. Thank you, Mike. So where were we? Oh, right. These are my feet, and these are my hands. This is my ear, and this is my nose. This is my father, and this is me. My father left no drawings, no poems, no writings, and no pictures. He left nothing but a void because he weighed 250 pounds. This is self-indulgent crap. This is just another film about myself, but sometimes that's okay. You never know who will one day care about you, no matter how big or small you think you are. This was me, Doc Yoker.